My name is Gene Moon, and I have the privilege and honor of taking the podium this week with the Cumberland Orchestra in concert this Sunday, July 7th, right here in Gary Hall on the campus of the University of the South. We have a great program lined up. I'm a kind of person who loves music with dance and a lot of rhythmic variations. And the two works that are bookending the program for the Cumberland Orchestra will give you exactly that. We open with the Cuban Overture by Gershwin, a tune that uh, Gershwin compiled during his visits to Havana. And of course, as we know, Havana has a lot of Spanish influence. So the other end of the bookend includes a Russian composer's impression of his thoughts and travels to Spain, which is by Rimsky-Korsakov, and will perform his Capriccio Español which is an interesting follow-up to last week's Cumberland performance of Capriccio Italian. In the middle, we're going to feature a guest soloist. My dear friend and colleague and faculty here, Josh Bynum, will perform the trombone concerto with orchestra by Lonnie Grandal. This work is extremely uh, full of sonorities and melodies that bring the trombone to a new light than what we may be used to hearing through large bands, jazz bands, and other kind of scenarios. Uh, Josh does an incredible job with his instrument and will coax melodies and lyrical lines that you may not have thought possible with such an instrument, but he marks it with grace and beauty and it's gonna be a delightful time. I hope you'll enjoy us again for Gershwin's Cuban Overture, Grandal's Trombone Concerto with guest soloist Josh Bynum, and we close it off with Rimsky-Korsakov's Capricho Español. See you then. Hi, Swanee. My name is Jimin Yu, and it's been such a pleasure spending the week here at the Swanee Summer Music Festival. I'm working with the Swanee Symphony, and we have a concert on Sunday that is all about water in our world. Uh, we start with a composer from the Czech Republic. His name's Smetana, and it's about the river that runs through the country and all the characters that you see on the riverside along the way. We then go to a New Zealand piece. This is a piece from my hometown. It describes the wind and the rain from Wellington and it's composed by Selina Fisher, one of the prominent New Zealand composers of today, uh, an old classmate of mine. She's so talented and it's a beautiful work. I hope you can come and enjoy it. And then after the break, we have Debussy's La Mer, it's all about the sea from his impressionistic uh, background and it's full of the French uh, sublime subtle colors and uh, a lot of his uh, respect and admiration for the sea. So come and enjoy such a wonderful colorful program with the Swanee Symphony on Sunday.